Jagernauts, it is Jager or Jay, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Season 2 of Crazy Craft. Now guys, first things first, I do want to apologize. I have been AFK for a few days. That is just because it is around Christmas time. I've been wanting to catch up with family and friends and also do a lot of the Christmas shopping and stuff like that that we have to do. We all have to do um, in preparation for Christmas. And I hope you guys are having an awesome, awesome holidays if you are on holidays. And if this has got like a few more days or if this is your last week, I hope you get through it and then you can all we can all be on holidays together so I hope you guys um, get through the last week and get through any exams or anything you may have and then we can get on holidays together but yeah I hope you guys are ready for Christmas I've been preparing like crazy it's been pretty hectic and it's very hot here in Australia so um, if you're having us if you're having a winter Christmas then I do feel uh, a little bit jealous of you I'm a bit envious of you because it has been very very hot here in Australia but anyway let's get into the uh, episode today I wanted to finish off off, well not finish off, but pretty much do Hawkeye the right way. At the end of last episode, we tried to shoot his bow and we worked out we couldn't fire any of the normal arrows. And a lot of you guys were saying, get a quiver in the comments section. Guys, I know that's not true. I know that's not right, because if we have a look, if I go and look for a quiver, um, if I spell it correctly, the only quiver, the only quiver in the game is this one here, the quiver. Um, it's not actually for this mod pack. I have I did it last season and I wondered why it wasn't working for Green Arrow. It's not actually for this mod pack and if there is a quiver in the Heroes Unlimited mod, well then I cannot see it anywhere. If you guys can see it, tell me because I honestly have looked through here countless times and I cannot see it anywhere. However, there is one thing that I thought may be able to be, maybe may work. Um, I thought like Hawkeye, what can he shoot? He shoot an arrow. Let's see if there's anything. And these two here come to mind. Explosive arrow and a grappling hook arrow. He shoots the grappling hooks arrows. He shoots grappling hook arrows and he also shoots explosive arrows. Now I'm pretty sure we're gonna need to get some of them. So let's work out how to craft them. For the explosive arrow, we need TNT and a normal arrow and the same as a same as a um, grappling hook arrow, but we need an enderpearl. So I'm pretty sure I have the resources to make myself a uh, a explosive arrow, I think. And before I don't have anything. Oh, we got some gunpowder. All right, sweet. I'm going to chicken chest that. We're going to get four and we'll get six. We'll get eight, sorry. Two for good luck. That's not what I meant to do. Uh, yeah, eight, two, for, uh, four for good luck rather. Um, and I also need some sand. So I got my shovel on me. We're going to go grab some sand really quickly unless I just derped out and I've already got some of that. I'm going to quickly double check. Nope, I don't believe I have any sand anywhere. No, I don't think so. So we're going to quickly grab some sand and we're going to make some TNT. The only thing is I don't believe we have any ender pearls. So that could be a bit of a problem. Maybe I could start working on getting to the end rather soon. That would be kind of cool, I think. We could take down the dragon, the end dragon with superhero powers. That would be awesome. Um, but first things first, we just need to we just take it one step at a time. We first need to get some sand so we can make some TNT, so we can make some explosive arrows, and hopefully uh, that actually works with my superhero, uh, which is Hawkeye. I completely forgot his name for a second. I was going to call him Green Arrow, but obviously that is not his name. Um, so what I need, I need some feathers. Please don't tell me I don't have any feathers. In which case I can just go kill one of those chickens, that is fine, but I thought I had some feathers. No, maybe I, maybe I, oh, three feathers, they're already in my inventory. Um, please stop that. I'm going to turn into a flying morph so you cannot do that anymore. Uh, suck it, ants. Suck it big time. Oh, I'm going to fall on top of them instead. Uh, okay, so let's make uh, TNT first. So we can do that. I need to get this out. One, two. Okay, that completely did not work. One, two, three, four, and like that. That's not the crafting recipe for TNT. It is like... I feel like such a jag, I should know this. I mean, I know I can search it, but I feel like such a jag. I should, ah, no, I know what it is. It goes like that. Derp, it, oops, that's not what I meant to do. It goes like that, that's a crafting recipe for DNT. Um, no? Okay, let's search it. I know, I'm sorry guys, I'm such a noob. I should know this, but I forgot. Is it like that? No, it's the other way around. Okay, I did have it right the, well, I almost had it right the first time, um, except it's like that, okay. 
I feel like I feel like a real big noob right now. Um, but there we go. We did get it eventually. Um, so there we go. One bit of TNT, and then I can just chicken chest it, y'all. We can just chicken chest it. I know a lot of you guys were getting frustrated that I wasn't chicken chesting some of the ores that I already had. So I'm going to chicken chest some TNT. Actually, I probably don't need that much because I can just make the arrows and then chicken chest the arrows. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's just make... Is that not the crafting recipe? TNT... Uh, or maybe I need a normal stick. Maybe it doesn't work with these acacia sticks. Oh, that's going to be frustrating. Um, please, I'm pretty sure I had one block of normal wood in here somewhere. Oak wood. Okay, let's see if that is the reason. Uh, let's go like that, make some normal sticks, and let's check it out. Let's find out if that's the reason or if it is completely different, actually. I think it might just be... Oh, no, it was. That was the reason. Okay, so we'll grab four of them, and I'll save some of those sticks because it looks like we need to use them for normal crafting recipes. Okay, so... And then we'll just chicken chest some of these arrows. Eight, uh, 12... No, sorry, 16, uh, 32, and 64... Thank you, I'll take that. Now we got 64 explosive arrows. Now this is the moment of truth. Can I actually shoot these arrows? What should we shoot at? Let's shoot at the squid. Let's see, moment of truth, does it work? Okay, uh, no hype. Unfortunately, it does not work. Actually, what if we... Surely... Okay, it does not work. That is a little bit... Unfortunate. I could have sworn that was how... Alright, well apparently the explosive arrows do not work. I thought I searched online and it said it worked and then I even just assumed that that would work. But what if we just chuck out these arrows? Come on, there has to be a way that this works. Now I'm not even drawing my bow. Why aren't I drawing my bow? What if I need to be myself? What if I need to be... I don't know why this isn't working. Let's try again. Oh, oh, did I need to click on it first? Let's see. Hey, we got it working. All right, see how much damage it does. Chicken. Goodbye. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I didn't mean to blow up my whole area like that. Oh, Jesus. That is a very strong arrow. We finally got it working. But, oh my God, I didn't mean to do that much damage. Let's shoot it at that over there and let's see how much damage it does. Oh, oh, I'm stuck. What? Why am I stuck? Let's fly out of here. I don't know... There we go. Let's get out of that nonsense. Don't know why that's happening. Um, okay, let's see. Can I even shoot that far? Yes, I can! Oh, take that! That is awesome! I shoot explosive arrows. That is cool. TNT? I mean, cacti get absolutely wrecked. Maybe it doesn't shoot that far. Can, does it shoot that far? Oh, it does shoot that far. I was just missing it. Okay. It looks like you've got to shoot slightly above the crosshair. And oh, that is so cool! Let's do it. it wouldn't do anything to the obsidian. No, nope, of course not. Um, okay, let's shoot out here. Alright, I think... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Why did it shoot the ground right next to me? That's weird. Okay, so apparently if you're standing on the ground, it shoots the ground. But if you're flying in the air, it actually works. So, that is good to know. We are wrecking that. Check that out. We are blowing holes in that pirate ship. Alright, let's go back to sleep. Um, and I just want to shoot this again because it's whole bunches of fun. Get out. Oh, that was so cool. That was so sick. Watch it again. Pow! It's like a... It's like a wave of sand. Oh, I just wrecked it. Now there's going to be water all over the place. Oh, sand get absolutely wrecked. Okay, that was cool. Um, okay, let's go back to sleep. I really should light up my area. It's just something I haven't um, bothered doing, to be quite honest. Um, although, where's my food at? Um, yeah, something I haven't bothered doing, lighting up the area, which is something I should do. Something I also should do is work on building like a bit of a base rather than just an open plan house where I can see the entire world. And hello, Mr. Blaze, we're looking right at your head. Um, but yes, we are just looking at... What was I saying? Oh yeah, we just got an open plan house, which I probably would like to fix up. Uh, eventually or pretty soon sooner rather than later but for now I guess we're just gonna go for it now what I wanted to do I want to make a new super superhero before the end of today's episode however first things first I want to test out uh, we're gonna back up for a second I need to get some golden apples and I want to test out Hawkeye's abilities once again against a caterpillar now last time it didn't fare we didn't fare very well we have already got a few golden apples Let's just grab a few more. Um, yeah, we didn't fare too well last time, unfortunately. Um, but we are going to try again. Now, I don't I don't think I have any enderpearls. 
Uh, so I cannot make his alternate, uh, the other option, which is the grappling hook bow. Oh, we do have some grappling, we do have some ender pearls. We look at that, maybe I can make some grappling hook bows. Uh, so let's go try, let's try them out as well. So, we're gonna need them, and we're also gonna need them. Let's make all of them. We got eight of those, and you know how we do, we're gonna chicken chest them, because they are annoying, and we, mm, I would rather prefer to keep my ender pearls, or I guess, this magical thing here called the chicken chest, we could just chicken chest it. Uh, but anyway, let's get all of this sorted. I want to keep, I want to keep the bow on me. I want to keep the ultimate bow on me because if Hawkeye's bow cannot take down the Catechiller, I'm going to swap out to the ultimate bow. Um, then we'll take some explosive arrows and I want to test out this grappling hook arrow. How does this work? Do I need to click on it first? And then let's try over there. No, that's, oops, that's, well, sorry, Mr. Tree. Uh, let's click on it. I don't know how I made it work last time. I should probably stop shooting at stuff right near my house with the explosive arrows. Uh, how? I, oh shoot, that's going to be explosive. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, that. Oh yes, it didn't blow up. Oh, you stay. Stay in there. Stay in there. I don't want water scattering around my whole area. How do I activate these grappling hook arrows? This is frustrating. Uh, grappling hook arrow? Nope, still the explosive arrow. Alright, let's get that out of my inventory. Let's try again. Nope, still the explosive arrow. Um, this thing's gonna go anyway. I'm gonna have to just destroy it 100%. Uh, but... That is shooting weird. I get, yeah, I honestly don't know how to use this thing. Why isn't it just very simple? Maybe gotta click it to alternate through it? I don't... I don't know. I don't actually know, which really sucks. I want to be able to use a grappling hook arrow, but... I guess we cannot use it, so that was a bit of a waste of two ender pearls. But anyway, we are going to call in a Caterkiller with 36 explosive arrows. See how we go. Let's call him in here and jump right back. Oh, he does so much. Oh, fudge me. Oh my god, he does so much. He is so scary in open layout. He moves so fast. All right, let's try for some long range hits. Uh, Mr. Mr. Caterkiller, eat my explosive. What? What? That does 450 attack damage. Get out of my face, Caterkiller. That does 450 attack damage with one shot. My face when I wish this was face cam because, oh my god. That does 450 attack damage. No wonder I don't, I can't withstand much, many hits because I can kill something in one shot. What? It doesn't even tell me how much damage it does, but I'm guessing it does more than 450. Holy moly! Let's try it again. Uh, let's try that again. What else can we? What else can we test on a Brutafly? Uh, they're gonna be flying around. It might be a little bit hard to hit. Uh, jumpy Bug. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Jumpy Bug, but you're gonna get yourself wrecked. Actually, does that still drop its loot? Because I need to pick up the Caterkiller jaws so I can make the Big Bertha sometime soon. All right, let's find out. Uh, please tell me you dropped your loot. I guess not. Oh wait, yes, oh no, that's just a rock. Stupid rock. I guess not. Oh yes, it does. Sweet! There it is, there's the Caterkiller Jaws. And all of this leather, which is a little bit neither here nor there. But we got a lot more food now, and we got some item frames, and we're pretty much full in our inventory. Probably should have done that before, but we did. Oh, Basilisks. We could test it out on a Basilisk as well. Alright, let's, let's do it. Let's go place in a Jumpy Bug. Now, he's probably going to hurt me quite a bit. Or not. Or no, he's going to absolutely fail. Alright. Oh, he's got 200. If I did 450 attack damage before, I should be able to absolutely stomp him right now. Uh-oh. Oh, this is his This is his advantage. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Ah, uh, get wrecked. Oh my god. Look how much that does. You stupid jumpy bug. Get absolutely shot in the face and destroyed. I cannot believe how much damage it actually does. Over 450 Testing it on a jumpy bug was pretty silly considering um, it already, he's 200, 250 health points lower than the, the bass, uh, not the bass, it's the caterkiller, so that was kind of silly. But anyway, let's eat a golden apple, I want to regen rather quickly, and then I want to take on our final boss, and then I want to make a new superhero, so I've got to rush this a little bit. Um, oops, that's, our inventory is full. Alright, let's get rid of that. Um, who was the final boss? The Basilisks. I want the Basilisk. I wanted to test him out. I'm pretty sure the Jumpy Bug's supposed to drop me his scale, but I guess he decided not to do that, so I'm going to have to fight another Jumpy Bug 
if I want to get all the resources for my uh, Big Bertha. So I'm guessing I'm gonna have to do that sometime soon, or as soon as I, as soon as another Easter Bunny um, lays a big or a jumpy bug egg, that'll be very preferable. Preferable, but uh, I don't really want to throw everything out. Everything will be useful at one stage or another. All right, let's test it on a jumpy bug. And I need to turn into a blaze for this one. I need to be able to fly away very quickly because the basilisk is going to make me slow and he's going to hurt me really bad. So we need to fly back, uh, jump back just a little bit. I'll pop a golden apple in a second. But for now, he's going to chill. How many, how many life points does he actually have? 400. All right. This will be a good test of Hawkeye's skill and ability. All right. Let's test it out. Um, let's get him right up in my face. And Hawkeye, do your business. Ready? Basilisk, come at me, and POW! Get wrecked! Get absolutely destroyed! This bow is awesome! No wonder I can't tank as many hits, because I can absolutely destroy in like, one shot. That is beautiful! This bow, man, this bow! With the explosive arrows, I wish I knew how to... I guess maybe that'll work. Why didn't I think about that before? Let's see if this works. Yes, it does! I don't know why I didn't think about that before. Ah, uh, let's, let's test this. Uh, it's, it's, eh, it's, it's alright. It's really not too great, but, I mean, it could get us out of some sticky situations if we ever got into any, uh, but... Oh, there they are. There they are. They're the explosive arrows. It's like, what? Anyway, we got them. That is all good. So we... Hawkeye's pretty... Hawkeye's pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. If, oh, except he keeps getting stuck on spots like that. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, he's pretty damn awesome. I'm a blaze, I should just fly. He's pretty awesome. I like his bow, but his ability is a little bit weak. If I could combine him with another superhero, which unfortunately I cannot. Uh, I might keep that and get rid of some of the junk. Uh, unfortunately, I cannot. I've already tested it. Um, and I do apologize if you guys have OCD. These chests are all over the place at the moment. I don't even know... I honestly don't even know what's going on in here. There's just random junk uh, from everywhere, so I do apologize. I guess I'll put them there with the others. That's the only bit that makes any sense. Um, and there's just food all over the place. Oh, we got an Eye of Ender. Let's try and work out which direction we need to go. Okay, so I guess that helps out a little bit. The, the Ender... That exploded. The Ender Portal is in that direction. So one day when we go looking for it, we should be able to find it and... I've actually, I could make some, there we go, I could actually make some Eyes of Ender, uh, right there, I could make some, um, but anyway, uh, what was I going to do, so I'm going to quickly put away something, so let's just take that out, and, uh, scrap that, and we'll put in the Basilisk, and also the Caterpillar Jaws, and there we go, we got six items towards the Big Bertha, I think we are going quite alright, quite decent, but anyway, I want to make a new superhero, well he's not a new superhero, he technically is an old one, but he is really really crucial in what I want to start doing, I think in the next episode, or possibly the episode after, but that is working on the blood magic, trying to, I want to try and rush through that, get like a tier 4 or tier 5 right off the bat, like instantly, so we can do some of the, some of the more powerful stuff, so if you don't already know, if I haven't already given it away, I want to make Deadpool. Now, Deadpool has ultimate regen, so it is really, really, really awesome. I, uh, it takes a lot of cloth and black iron blocks, which uh, I forgot about. I'm not even sure if I'm going to have enough. That's a lie. I've got a chicken chest, but I prefer to go. I prefer to go mining for at least one lot of black iron, seeing as it is one of the uh, most common minerals. I'm going to go mining for that. As soon as I get four more and I can make a block, I know I just finished saying that a lot of you guys prefer it when I can just, um, oh, let's put Groot on. I think he has, I think he has constant night vision or is it beast? I don't know which one it is, but he has constant night vision. I think it's beast actually. Night vision, yes. Okay, let's go. Um, as soon as I find four bits or four more pieces of black iron, which should be quite simple because usually it's exposed in caves. Um, I will I will bounce and I'll just chicken chest the rest But I feel like I need at least one block before I go and get like 10 or 20 blocks However much I need and in before I put my foot in my mouth What's through here? I think it just leads out. Yeah, it just leads out Yeah, in before I put my foot in my mouth and one of the most common resources or minerals isn't actually in the cave so That's a that's a little bit annoying. I've got half a mind just a chicken chest although I do know there's a cave entrance just here. Let me just quickly check in here. 
or down here. And if not, then I will chicken chest. Oh my god. I would prefer to have four. Oh no, it's going to take way too long. I'm going to have to set up a, a miner's dream kind of mine down there. Actually, I'm going to do that right now. Seeing as we have the constant night vision, I will do that right here. Right now. And we can get four black. We'll get the four black iron we need. And then we'll smelt it all up. We'll chicken chest it. Um, and we'll be all good. There we go, there are minus dreams. Last chest I looked in, always the way. But yeah, I just feel a little bit better about myself. Uh, we'll just go straight down from this point here. I feel a little bit better about myself when I do things kind of semi-legitimate. I know technically a lot of you guys said I did earn the chicken chest. It took me so long to find the resources. Yes, that is correct, but it should take me a lot longer to find all of the other resources. But look at that. If you ask, ask and you shall receive. Mine straight down and I got five bits of black iron. So I feel I feel confident now. I feel I feel like I can chicken chest the rest. Why not? Well, we'll go ahead and chicken chest the rest um, after I smelt. Oh my god! I already had some cooking. Well, we can cook up the rest, and there we go. I wouldn't have even looked in there if I didn't have it. So either way, we had to go looking for it. Um, but let's go. Let's do this. Let's get one block, and I think we needed how many did we need? We needed none, we needed six, we needed uh, nine, and we needed two, so we need 11 in total. Uh, so one, two, three, and four, and that should be enough. There we go, 16. That is plenty. Now I need the red cloth, which I think I brought, no, I made the purple cloth. I made the purple cloth last time, hey. Well, that is okay, because I did go and put some Oh, I wish I put cloth around. No, that's that would have been stupid. You can't put any colored cloth around here. So yeah, that's perfect. We'll mine up some. I really should have brought shears. Can I make shears? No, I can't make shears. I'll just mine up some of this, and we'll just go and chicken chest it. So four, I think it's five, or it's either four or five. I really should memorize the recipe on how to make cloths. It's like honestly the the number one crafting recipe in making uh, in making the superior stuff. So I really should memorize it. Oh no, oh no! Please tell me, please tell me I have some string. Or, not string, spiderweb or string, that's the one, that's actually the right one. I, s I swear I had string. Anyway, we can we can still go ahead and make this, I just gotta get... Uh, okay, this is perfect, I need some red wool. So what I can do, I can... I'm trying to work out how I can do this. Actually, can I do this? I think in Crazy Craft I can't. Cotton! I've got a cotton farm! I'm a loser! I, I forgot about my cotton farm. And I probably have some... Oh wait, I already had some cotton, didn't I? Anyway, we've got a cotton farm. I can make some string. Let's do that. Let's do that. I've got a cotton farm. I already had some cotton in here, didn't I? Pretty short. Oh, I got one. Okay, look at that. Look at that. I actually I actually know some crazy craft. Look at that. That's actually great news. Um, so, let's do this. Let's get a stack. And as soon as I get my golden farm, golden enchanted golden apple cow farm up and running, I will be doing it more legitimately. But as of this point, I do not. Uh, so let's see. The white the cloth goes there. Uh, so one, two, three, four, and then we go around the, around the outside, around the outside, and that's perfect. And now I just need to make some red cloth. So I put my die away. Let's go like that. Uh, let's also go like. That. that shouldn't be a problem, that'll be alright. Uh, so now, I think we're gonna need a butt ton, a metric poop ton. That is a weird, a weird uh, metric unit to go in, but anyway, uh, we'll get a metric lot, a, met, a metric lot, that's weird. Uh, a metric lot of red wool, so we can make it into red cloth. Uh, we're gonna need two, four, six, and seven, eight, and nine, ten, eleven. My maths have got to actually count that, that was embarrassing. Um, but anyway, uh, so we just need to go, uh, are we even going to have enough? We will technically have enough because we could ultimately chicken chip. What am I doing? What am I doing? Let's go like this. There we go. So much smarter. Um, we could, oh, I could have done that way more efficient anyway. Um, but yeah, we could uh, chicken chest those and it looks like I won't need to because I only needed 11 and I made 44, so rookie error there. But anyway, let's go ahead and make some. So we need to go like that and like that. There we go, Deadpool helmet. Uh, we also need to go like that and like that. And Deadpool chest plate and like that and like that. And like this and like that. Nope. 
Deadpool boots, and the one thing I forgot is that one, and that's very simple. So all we need is like butter bing and butter. But a boom, if I get the crafting recipe right, I would have been able to say that like two seconds ago, but unfortunately I was did not. All right, uh, now we need we need to get a new, what's I'm gonna call it? All right, on, honestly, I'm just gonna get rid of this for now. I do obviously need to set up a stand for him, but at the moment I don't have the resources, so let's just go like that. And let's suit up with our new superhero Deadpool. Um, so that's gonna be way more efficient when I'm trying to work on the blood magic stuff next episode. So guys, that is gonna be the end of today's episode. I, we've already done a massive segment on Deadpool before, but we can test him out next episode as well. But there we go, he still looks as epic as I remember, especially standing in the XP farm and killing some of the ants. Did I kill him? Yes, I killed him. But guys, I hope you have enjoyed today's episode. It has been a bit of a kind of grindy episode, but we do need to have those once in a while. And the, we worked out that the, the Hawkeye bow is super, super effective when we can actually get shots off. So that is really, really good news. But guys, I hope you have enjoyed. I hope you're getting ready for Christmas as I am. And I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new episode. Bye, guys.